Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. Now the news in detail. Why was I detained for two years and ten days? Who is responsible for the suffering and hardship? There was no immediate answer to 48-year-old Dulubi BB question on Friday, days after she was declared an Indian citizen, following what seemed like a never-ending nightmare. It was in 2017 that BB was declared a foreign by a foreigner tribunal in Assam because of inconsistency in her name in the voter list and sent to detention camp, where she spent two years. But the ordeal started much earlier in 1997. In fact, a resident of Kaspur village in Assam, Kachar district, BB first came under the scanner of the electoral registration officer during the revision of electoral rolls from the Udhar Bond Assembly constitution that year. Her name listed as Dulubi BB in the draft electoral roll and had not featured in earlier voter list, which cast a doubt on her citizenship. A case was registered under the Illegal Migrants Act the following year, but the on it was only in 2015 that she received a notice from the Foreigner Tribunal. On March 20, 2017, the tribunal declared her as a foreigner who had entered the country after March 25, 1971. Six years on, it has been established that the Dulubi BB in 1997 electoral roll was the same person as Dulab Jan Begum in the 1993 voter list, and details of her father and grandfather could be traced back to 1965 voter list. In the interim, she spent two years in detention camp in Silchar before she was released on bail on April 27, 2020. After I was released, I had kept Traveling up and down from Silchar by myself without my husband because it was too expensive for both of us, she said, adding that her each trip cost her around six hundred. After she was declared a foreigner in 2017, BB approached the Guwahati High Court, armed with voter list going back to 1965, that contained the names of her grandfather, the father. Her grandfather's name appeared as Majmil Ali in 1965 voter list. The 1985 voter list contained the name of her father as Sirai Mia Laskar, son of Majmil Ali Laskar, while in the 1993 voter list referred to him as Sirai Mia, son of Majmil Ali. The 1993 voter list referred to her Dolab Jan Begum, the daughter of Sirai Mia. BP pointed out this is continuity to prove that she is an Indian citizen. The High Court in April acknowledged that if this continuity were confirmed, she would have discharged the burden of her proof. However, the court stated that it first had to be confirmed whether Majmil Ali and Majmil Ali Laskar, Sirai Mia and Sirai Mia Laskar, and Dolob Jan Begum and Dulu Bibi, different names in the different voter list, were the same people. The court remanded the matter back to the tribunal to examine and verify that Bibi was referring to and pass an order accordingly. In an order dated October 7, the Foreigners Tribunal 3 in the Silchar stated that on the basis of the documents submitted, it found very much detailed information of the relationship of BB family member, which revealed the continuity of the family. It declared that she is a citizen of India, born out of Indian citizen, living in Indian soil. That is the end of the story. If you like the content of our video, please do hit the subscribe button, share it with your families and friends, and do not forget to post a suggestion in the comment section below. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye bye.